Jazz Aviation here, and welcome to my Christmas unboxing special. Hope you're having an awesome Christmas and a lovely time. So here we have my Qantas 7879 that I got for my birthday just a few months ago, but that's not what we're focusing on today. What we're going to be focusing on is, ta-da, the Gemini Jets 1400 Airport Terminal. And I have to say, it looks pretty cool. Now it does work with Gemini Jets and Phoenix models, and I think it may work with other ones, but I'm not sure. If you know which other ones it works with, please let me know. Yeah, so we've got some nice LEDs that are powered by two AA batteries, air bridges with gates, we've got little garages which you can store little things, and there's lots of details on the top. And a re really cool thing that I like is that this button which does the uh, LEDs, it looks like it's part of the airport, like a part of the building, so it's really cool. So it doesn't matter if it's like on or not, it doesn't look like a massive on and off switch, it actually looks like it's part of the building. But yeah, just pressing that will uh, turn on the LEDs. And yeah, it does come with gates and air bridges which are really cool. They do move in and out. And uh, the, en the exits or entrance, whatever they're called, the endings, right? They can move and swivel around like that. You've also got wheels, which can turn around. And you've also got this metal staircase, which does move and can fall off easily. Just be careful of that. But um, yeah, this is a pretty cool model, airport. And yeah, so that wasn't all that I got uh, plane related for Christmas at the moment. Um, so I got a few models, and uh, yeah, also there is uh, this uh, road bridge which you can attach to the airport. I don't think I'll be using it though, since my airport is going to be right against the wall, so it won't be any point. But uh, yeah, let's go into the special models that we've got. Now I've got three models, two one for hundred models. So our first one is a Planet Airways Boeing 727 by Gemini Jets, 1400, and it is amazing. We've got different information on there about the stuff, and pause it there if you want to read it. A nice, cool, translucent coloured window looking at the plane, and the old Gemini Jets box design which looks really nice. And on the back, you've got the little description on Gemini Jets. And uh, yeah, so let's open this baby. So a little cool fact about the 727 is that it's been dubbed the loudest airliner in the world because it's got loud screeching, roaring engines, which are apparently really loud. And uh, yeah, it was the, one of the early airliners that Boeing made. And let's open up. I really like this uh, translucent coloured plastic as well. So just slide that off gently. It's a little stuck sometimes, but we'll get it off. There we go. And here we have the Planet Airways 727 by Gemini Jets. And it looks awesome. So this is an American airline as well. And yeah, I love the tail of the earth and the stars. It's got its um, uh, iconic three engines as the 727 has, it's a trijet. We've got its registration number. We've got the emergency exits on the wings. You've got nice details for doors and windows. You've got the planet logo. And let's zoom into the cockpit. You've got that classic Boeing cockpit look. Look at the windows. Very nice. And we turn it around this way. And it's the same on the other side. Really cool model. Uh, I'd never heard of Planet Airways until I saw this, but uh, yeah, 
So that is the Planet Airways 727. And because we've got the airport ready, we should probably dock it up to one of the gates. So here we go. Oh, okay. So if you have like a small model like this, the gates don't really got, fit onto it that well. But luckily, we can move that out of the way. Put that there. And we'll get the stair gate truck that I got for my birthday. There we go. So yeah, that is the Planet Airways Boeing 727. So we'll move that out of the way for the next model. So our next model isn't for the airport, it's one for the collection and one for the shelves. Awesome plane, one of my favourites. Uh, it was a British war legend called the Vulcan Bomber. And here it is. Got a stand and nice painted details. Now this is going to be hard to open, so I'll be right back. And we are back, and here we have the Vulcan Bomber. Ah, oh, here we go. The scale is 1-234. So yeah, we've got some awesome painted details. Nice little cockpit. And, oh, I love it. I only saw this plane flying once, and it was so loud. Probably one of the loudest bombers out there. And the wings are painted nicely. A little bit of paint coming off, but that's not too bad. You've got the British flag up there and its registration code. We've got the classic uh, Vulcan paint there. And yeah, oh, the stand as well, it's pretty good. And if we take a look at the bottom, it's pretty much just blank. But we can actually see there are some little details on there. We've got the undersides of the engines, little details on the wings. Uh, there's the bomb hatch, and there's also the landing gear parts. Oh, it doesn't come with any landing gear though, but it's still a really cool model. So yeah, that is... Actually, I don't know what, I don't know what company it's made by. But that is the Avro Vulcan model. And I'm going to keep that forever, it's very special. Alright, so here's the last model for our unboxing. And it is massive. And I mean huge. So, um... Here we have... The Gemini Jets UAE in space. Emirates A380 and it is massive so yeah we'll get down to opening this now I have to open this off camera because of how big it is so I'll be back so we are back and after a bit of a hard opening here she is and I put it next to my hand it is quite big but yeah there it is the Emirates A380 UAE in space. Now this A380 marks the Emirates, uh, the United Arab Emirates going into space. And uh, yeah, it's an awesome plane. We've got a little astronaut there with the Earth and the space station. And it says, the sky is only the beginning. So let's get a look at uh, the details. So the engines all have the little Emirates logo there. There's lots of details. You have the Airbus A380 good marking there. Awesome cockpit details. Let me turn it around. Same on the other side. And yeah. Um, the windows and doors are painted very nicely. And the tail is awesome and you can tell that's emirates just by looking at that it's amazing and just to show how big it is let's get the 7879 
and put it next to it. So that's the scaling how they two look next to each other. And here we have the Rainbow Roo A330. And then we've got the little 727. Now that is awesome. It's huge. It's quite heavy too. And yeah, um, we pick it up and take a look at the underside. We've got Emirates. And we've got one, two, three, four, five landing gear parts. That's awesome. So put it back down, being very careful because of how big it is. And uh, yeah, we might as well hook it up to the airport to see what it looks like. Another thing about the gates is they're a little bit finicky and can come off easily. But yeah, there we go. So there we have it. So that concludes the Christmas unboxing. Hope you enjoyed. And uh, please make sure to like and subscribe for more. And follow me on Instagram, which I'll link in the description. I've been very active on there, taking photos of planes and all sorts. And posting lots of content. Have an awesome Christmas. I'll see you later. Bye.